Hi there, my name is Andres Peña and I'm a pen tester at Red Center and today I'm going to talk to you about MSP cybersecurity tool. First of all, what is an MSP? An MSP stands for a managed service provider, which is a company who delivers services such as network, application and infrastructure via ongoing and regular support and active administration on customer premises in their MSP's data center or in a third-party data center, like for instance, the cloud. MSPs may deliver their own native services in conjunction with other provider services. For instance, a security MSP providing sysadmin on top of third-party cloud infrastructure as a service. Pure play MSPs focus on one the vendor or technology, usually their own core offerings. Many MSPs include services from other types of providers as well. The term MSP traditionally was applied to infrastructure or device-centric types of services, but has expanded to include any continuous, regular management, maintenance, and support services. An MSP is focused on usability and performance, while an MSSP, which stands for Managed Security Service Provider, is focused on security. That's right. Your MSP is responsible for preventing, detecting, responding to threats before the wreck happens. Sadly, data breaches are common in this age and day. A breach can ruin a customer's trust and company's reputation in a matter of seconds. It's key for the success of your business that you keep your data well protected from outside eyes. An MSSP also understands that there are security and privacy regulations that companies must follow. MSSPs are experts are ensuring a company is doing all that it needs to do to comply. This can be a huge weight of, of your company and can free up your legal and IT team to focus on their other activities. Once we know the difference between all of them, what are the threats that they protect you of? The most common vectors of, of attack in 2022 are credential theft with a 19%, phishing with a 16%, misconfigured cloud, an interesting one, with 15%, and vulnerabilities in third-party software with 13%. It takes a staggering 327 days to identify and contain a compromise through a stolen credentials. The same logic applies to phishing for 295 days and lastly to misconfigured cloud with 244 days. Remember, this has average duration. Do you want to, to have a data breach? I guess the response is not. Can MSSPs do for you in order to prevent that? The main solutions MSSP deliver to clients nowadays are managed detection and response to ensure the security of system and data, incident management to respond to detect and respond to an attack, security asset management to continuously identify an organization's IT assets and ensure they're accessible only by authorized personnel and all security gaps are closed firewall management, configuration and monitoring to ensure a secure network, manage endpoint detection and prevention to block threats at the device level, manage network security to identify and respond to network threats, manage threat detection to detect and isolate advanced threats that evade existing security solutions, Batch vulnerability management to ensure that operating systems and application patches are installed on a timely basis. Virtual private network management to ensure a business has a safe, encrypted, and online connection to the corporate network. And last but not least, security awareness to improve a client's security posture and ensure the organization is well prepared for cyber attacks at all levels. At Red Century, we help MSPs by delivering quality, automated, and manual services to enhance their vulnerability management solutions. So, why don't you put hackers on the right side of this question this time?